Hello, everybody. Saturday, March 20. At least for me it is, in Santa Fe. I mean, sort of two or three or something. Um, everything we talk about, you know, everything we talk about is based on what the little bit that I know about how, the Buddhist model of the mind. It's really quite fascinating. The words we all know, love, compassion, attachment, jealousy, pride, we, these are such simple words, you know. Buddha doesn't use words like bipolar, schizophrenia, OCD, ADHD, PTSD, all these things. That's okay, nothing wrong. But he's got his own view and he's got his own way of seeing and we know these words so intimately. But the crucial thing is he, he, he distinguishes them in a very particular way. You know, the, the key Buddhist thing is that he's found from his own experience that we can eventually get rid of all the rubbish. It's quite radical, it's quite shocking actually. You go to a therapist and say, give me methods to get rid of all anger, all fear, all jealousy. Impossible, ridiculous. But that's the Buddha's view. So taking that in mind, keeping that in mind, then it implies that we need to distinguish between those and the other stuff, which is at the core of our being. Love, kindness, compassion, you name it. So taking that as our view, then we can learn to interpret in our mind. We, learn to, we have to learn to distinguish. And this is like trying to distinguish between herbs and, flat, herbs and weeds when you don't know botany. It's impossible. This is the hard job. So when we start to learn to know the difference, so, for example, attachment and love, we almost mix these together. We think they're the same thing. But if we look at them in this distinct way that the Buddhist approach takes, attachment, if we just took it on its own, it's this unhappy, neurotic, fear-based, needy, emotional, manipulative, control freak, all those words we know, that's attachment. Now, luckily, our saving grace is we have love, which is kindness, compassion, wanting others to be, no, not compassion, it's the opposite. Love is, the compassion is about suffering. Love is, may you be happy. You delight in a person's happiness. It's so amazing. But to see the difference between these two is a miracle, and that's our job. That's our job. So when we see attachment, it's coming from the neurotic part of ourselves. It's needy. All it wants is the right, all it wants is what I want. But love is more spacious. It's connected to the other. And our key job is to see the difference, you know, and that's the key to success. Your, your own happiness, your own sanity, and your ability to be useful to others. We have to talk about it more. Can't do much in one minute and 30 seconds. Goodbye, sweethearts.